Uh, we're standing at the corner of Library Lane and Adam Street on the city-owned parcel that's shown in the new general plan as to be the site of the Historical Society and Community Center. Right now, our office is at the St. Lena Public Library, which we are just so grateful to have. And um, we have uh, no place else to put our collection. I think one of the, one of the great things was the acquisition of the St. Lena Star which is a great resource for anybody that wants to uh, check back and see what, what has taken place. Along with that is the uh, St. Helena Sentinel, which went out of publication many years ago. We have some artifacts that were unearthed during the building of the flood control project that go back to uh, many years before the white immigrants came to this country. Then on up and, and through the uh, agricultural development of the community and I think those things are extremely important to our children and the people that come after us. We have um, the McCormick buggy that they used at the McCormick Ranch. So this buggy belonged to my grandfather John McCormick. Um, he was a supervisor starting in 1915 for eight years. So my mother Babe Learned and I donated the buggy to uh, the St. Lane Historical Society where it's sitting in the storage unit waiting for them to have a facility where they can display it for the public to see. We have all of this farm equipment that we could have displayed outside so children can see how farms were worked. Students need to feel connected to their community even if their family wasn't from this community. If you have a history center where they can go to and see the different items that people owned and appreciate them then they'll hopefully care for their community too in the same way. Young people and older people can go again and research maybe their own heritage. Uh, I, I, we all need a home. So it's time for people to see what we have and how much we have and to enjoy bringing their family, bringing their guests that come visit them. This will be a tourist attraction. It will be a a building that's uh, large enough to host some events. We would like to have a commercial kitchen that would be available for various events. As time goes on, we'll have a new city hall nearby here one day, and uh, this will be a vital part of the, the city of St. Helena. I mean, the legacy that we can leave to the town and the young children is just unbelievable. To be able to show them how we became what we are today, to be able to save this story. A couple of years ago, more than 700 residents signed petitions favoring the establishment of a history center. Now the time has come and we need your support. Please join us in our commitment to preserving our history in a space worthy of such a great town. It's my story too. Es mi historia también. It's my story too. It's also my story. This is my story too. The stories belong to all of us.